Hi everyone, this is Steve with Steph and Marcus. Today we're gonna to talk about grind settings. We had a lot of questions come in regarding what grind setting we recommend for various brew methods. So, but generally speaking, the concept here is that the slower the brew method, the coarser the grind. The faster the brew method, the finer the grind. Okay, so the idea is you're increasing the contact time between the grounds and the water for slower grinds, and you're decreasing the contact time between the water and the grounds for faster brews, okay? So on the, this end of the spectrum, we have coarse ground coffee. This is the consistency of sea salt. It's really good for things like uh, overnight brews, such as cold brews. The next level up we have here is medium coarse. This is the consistency, it's a little finer than sea salt, but not quite as fine as granulated sugar. This is really good for French press or press pots methods. The next level we have over here is medium grinds, and that's the consistency of granulated sugar, and this is really good for things like pour overs and automatic brewers, anything that's kind of uh, you use with a gravity-fed uh, water over the grinds. Then the next level we have is fine. This is the consistency of baker sugar, so it's more finely ground than granulated sugar. This is really good for things like mocha pots, you know, think, uh, uh, pots that are under, under some form of pressure. And then finally we have super fine, which is the consistency of flour. And this is good for espresso, okay? These are the grind settings we recommend for each brew method. Super fine for espresso, fine for mocha pots, medium for pour overs and automatic brewers, medium coarse for press pots or, or uh, French presses, and coarse grind for things like uh, overnight brews such as cold brew. There you have it.